Hi, so I want to show you a bit about this uh, heater uh, bed expansion module in case your motherboard cannot handle uh, big wattage beds. Um, it's a pretty common one used in 3D printers. It's called uh, HW700. Uh, the MOSFET here can handle, I think, around 100 ampere, so it's it can handle, I think, almost anything. Uh, but I wanted to show you how this one works. So you connect the power from the power supply here. You see, it says DC in. This one is the plus. This one is the minus. And here you connect the hotbed. I connected the LED an LED with a resistor so you can see when it turns on and off and uh, here is the control this wire you connect to the motherboard where you would connect the heater bed and it's uh, it, it it will take in 12 or 24 volts here that will turn this MOSFET and make the power from the power supply flow through here but there's a few things about this. So because it has a, a bridge rectifier here, it doesn't matter the polarity of how you connect these wires to your motherboard. So it's plus minus doesn't really matter. I'll show you in a, in a bit. And um, there's one more thing. Uh, normally this will only be triggered or turned on only with 12 or 24 volt. That's the way it comes. So what controls that, let me see if I can focus, okay, it's this resistor here, you see it's uh, 1, 2, 3, it says here, that's 10K. Um, if you want to use this and turn it with your microcontroller like an ESP32 that uses 3.3 volts, you need to desolder this, you see I, I already done it before. So you, you desolder this one and you put a 102 aka 1k here and it will, if you put a 1k here you can connect this to your ESP and trigger this MOSFET and everything will work. But normally the, this module is made so you just connect it to your to the output of your motherboard just connect these wires to the power supply and the bed here. Now let's also make a demonstration. So this is my 24 power supply. I'll connect, so this is the plus. I'll just stick it in here. Now I have this wire connected to the minus. And I will connect it to this wire. You see it has an LED here presence one that shows that we have power here and uh, you take this so you see this is plus and minus and I will show it will work both ways you see the moment I put this here it also has a, a presence LED here but you can see the big LED turning on aka the bed Okay, now I'm gonna put the other polarity to show you it doesn't matter. See? It works both ways, both ways. So there's no worry how we connect this. Let me disconnect this so I don't burn something. Uh, you just make sure that you have this um, um, this one here, this piece, because this Chinese modules you never know. <laughs> so this is a bridge rectifier, this one. Okay, this is it. Hope you enjoy it. Like and subscribe if you want to see more.